Pride and pride, 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 pride and how many times do I have to say I was just playing? We don't play around like that in this house. You need to go and play around with some little kids and stop talking to me so much. We love how you like to say things to trigger people and then you get mad when they call you out. True T. When you say things to get a rise out of people, you got to deal with that later. Don't try to run from the retaliation. Well, we can't blame her because running is the only thing she good at. You really trying it right now. I twerk, these boobs perk, and I leave all these haters irk, including you. Them boobs are not perked. More like bent. She got bent boobs. <laughs> you know what? Let me go rock this hat before I rock one of y'all. Not you, Pride of Man. Let me guess. Another package for Pride. Remember me? Of course I remember you. You Dennis, right? I mean, Stanley. Your name start with an A, right? Predisha, who is at the door? You letting flies in. Flies go wherever she go, Grandma. Watch what you say about her. Or what? You gonna set it off? Okay, Frankie. Oh, yeah, Frankie. That's your name. It is sickening that you've had so many men that you don't even remember their names. His name is Ismani. Wow, Grandma older than you and she got better memory. It must be the fish fumes attacking your brain cells. No, it's just that she don't get dudes like me, so she got the brain capacity to remember names. Oh, that's really the reason. Hold up. It was something different about you last time I was here. Nah, it ain't nothing different about me. I ain't changed. Not you, little man over there. I got new hands now did you come over here just to talk to them or to see me like what is you doing i really came over here to get some money oh i know you lying you ain't been in my life for how many months are you coming over here to get some money uh-uh how your name is money and you don't even have none my name is money oh head that's what i said somebody better talk to him don't call me that come on let's just go upstairs before probably may whoop your ass nah i ain't here for that i came to get the money he took for my little sister that was so long ago Hi. Leave me and my family alone like you left me alone when I was pregnant with your baby. Shoot, he got me bent. Perdisha actually stood up for us? This is shocking. Speaking of shocking, does anybody- Wait, don't get too excited too fast. The only reason I did all that is because I don't like rejection. And he rejected me in front of all of y'all. So I had to kick him out. It's called damage control. Well, since you know about all that, you need to control the damage that you're doing to yourself by dating all these wild heathens. Grandma, I think you need to open your shop back up so you ain't worried about all my business. Can anybody tell me why? Blah, blah, blah. Shut up, Protestant. Nobody wants to hear you. We already know you probably about to say something smart about me. How could I do that when everything about you is stupid? Boy, please. The only thing stupid about me is how stupid thick my back be. Perdisha, I'm not even trying to argue with you right now. I want to let y'all know that I don't feel like myself. What's going on? Speak up, little bro. That's what I've been trying to do, but people keep cutting me off. What's bothering you, baby? Why don't you feel like yourself? It's that leftover trauma from that toy he was messing with. Perdisha, you know what's upstairs? Your mama. Go talk to her. I ain't got nothing to say to her. And if you don't want to talk to your mom, the shower is upstairs too. You can definitely visit her. So what's been bothering you? A lot of things. I just feel really scared. Like, I have a lot of mood swings. One minute I'm real happy, then the next minute I'm angry. And I feel like somebody's watching me. Oh, baby, your body is just going through changes. You getting older. Um, what's that word called? Puberty. Oh, yeah, it's that puberty. Is puberty supposed to make your hands feel like it's electric running through them? Look, I'm sorry to break it to you, but it's called puberty. Oh, my bad. I talk shit. I like money. I like bed. I really just miss having him by my side. It's the tearless crying for me. This is why I didn't want to come up here and talk to you. You need to get over this turd. Flush him out of your memories. He really got you looking a little poopy. Pradisha, this is not a game. It's the rap game. <laughs> Sorry, I've been watching that a lot lately. I know it's not a game. I'm just saying, like, you could do better. Why did that sound like lyrics to a popular song? But do you really think so? 
Uh, I know so. But for starters, you need to scrap that wig. It's the fusions that's stopping people from liking you. Well, you know I got this hair because of Predante. Okay, and he's not here anymore, so what's the reason for you still having it? I just don't feel like going to buy a whole new wig. Uh-uh, that excuse is lamer than the kids who play Yu-Gi-Oh! in the far front corner in the cafeteria. You need to hit us with the switcheroo. Where's that old wig Pra got you? That's the wig I was wearing when Predante took the ring back! Prada! Stop crying over that man! And Predisha, it's nice that you wanted to talk to your mom, but go get in that shower too. You said either or. We're leaving. Come on. When I was your age, Protestant, this was my favorite movie. And it's my favorite now. Thank you for showing me because I really needed this. Of course. We all need QT sometimes. Pry, she is cute, but I don't want to date her. What? What are you talking about? You just said we all need a QT sometimes. I said we all need QT. That stands for quality time. Oh, okay. Well, Pry, can I tell you something? And I need you to promise that you won't tell anybody else. Especially not Grandma. Because I don't want her to faint. Wait, how serious is this? It's this serious. No way. This can't be real, though. I'm about to call you Matilda. I don't like that name. Hi, y'all. Bye, y'all. No time to talk. I got to go gather some materials. That was close. I'm still shook. I told you I've been feeling different lately. And it ain't no puberty. Because I looked that up on Google. Oops. Some pep in your step, Perdisha. I'm not going downstairs until I know that you in that shower. I ain't know I needed a shower monitor. Well, now you do. And you're lucky I'm not charging for this. Speaking of charging, how much do you think it would cost for you to, um, mind your own business? Oh, I'm sorry, honey. That was a fly. See, it's from your smells. You need to go get in that shower. Stop playing. Wait, did you just hear that? Oh, I did hear no shower running because you're not in it. I'm going, Grandma. Relax. But I think you should go check out that noise. It sounds like somebody broke something. And it smells like you broke the record for the world's longest shower drought. Now stop worrying about other people. Worry about yourself. You know what would be nice? If you took your own advice. And you would stop smelling sour if you would just get in the shower. This is your last call, Predante, or I'm replacing you. What you mean? I'm irreplaceable. Look, I know Predante and Beyonce sorta of, kinda of rhyme, but that don't apply to you. It could be done. Build a man workshop, here I come. I didn't mean to break it. I didn't mean to break it. I don't want anybody to find out I have powers. Well, for starters, let's keep it down a little bit and just relax. All we gotta do is tell them that you made a mistake and bumped into the table and knocked down the picture frame. Yeah, I guess we can do that. But I'm still nervous because I've been having dreams about Rodriguez and Sporky. And I feel like... Well, I know that they are the reason I can do this. The name isn't Sporky, remember? It's him. Well, I like to call him Sporky. It fits better. I mean, I guess you got a point. But how long have you been able to do this? I found out yesterday when I was about to brush my teeth, I pointed at my toothbrush and it moved a little bit. But I can't always do it. And I can only pick up light objects. You better actually be in that shower perdition and not sitting on the toilet. How many times do I have to tell you, Grandma, I'm in the shower? If you come out that bathroom and you got any dry parts on you, I'm going to roast you to ashes. I think you need to do a little bit more worrying about your dry parts. That's why Prager left you for Auntie Pradabel. <gasps> Did I just say that? I'm so sorry, Grandma. You little bee. That stung a little bit. I guess I'll go and check on Pride and Protestant now. It's always something happening to me. I wonder if God really loved me. That should never be a question. God is love, and it can't be any other way. Well, if he really loved me, why do he let this stuff happen to me? It's not like God is just sitting around making your life what it is. If God not doing it, then who is? You. We. We are. We create our reality. I think you need to stop listening to Kanye West. Oh, hey, Grandma. Nothing out of the ordinary is happening down here. Pride just helping me with my schoolwork. Mmm, I smell baloney. I don't know why, Grandma, because we don't eat that in here. It's just something fishy about what's going on down here. Baloney and fish don't smell nothing alike. And Perdisha is upstairs, so it's nothing fishy down here. I heard some sort of glass breaking. What was that? Um, I don't know what you're talking about, Grandma. Pride, do you? Uh, um, yeah, it was the TV. We had the TV up really loud, and one of the commercials was showing, um, how adorable some glass was. Yep, the glass was so adorable, and somebody had a crush on it. That's what that sound was. Oh, okay, because I know my two honest, respectful, and trustworthy grandsons would never lie to me over something that they could just tell me the truth about. 
Look who's back. Mom is back. No, that don't sound good like the grandma song. All right now, Protestant, I can take back these gifts I got you. Hey, Mom, you bought us gifts? Nobody said anything about you. So you really didn't bring anything for pride? He is really independent, remember? He doesn't need me to buy him gifts. I don't need you to buy him, but it would be nice. It would, wouldn't it? It would also be nice if you went straight, but that's asking too much, isn't it? It is. It's like you want me to backhand you. I told you to stop being rude about his sexuality. Look, Mom, I am not a child anymore, and these are my children, and this is how I want to raise them. This is my house, too. Uh, did you forget? I might have, just like you forgot to pay your mortgage and your other bills that you leave for pride to cover. Can y'all stop fighting? I just want to have fun. Let's play this game. Nope, I can't. Play with your brother. Play with your grandmother. I got to set up something. It's okay, Protestant. You wouldn't be able to beat her in this game anyway. That's the sorriest mother I know. So, you sat on the toilet running water for hours instead of actually getting in the shower? Stop asking with such a judgmental tone. And yes... That is so stupid because you still gonna smell the same. No, I am not because I sprayed a whole half a bottle of smoke out on my clothes. Mm -mm -mm. Sassy, moody. Spreadsheet.